tow truck driver is recovering after he was shot on the job. It's a story you'll only see on CBS 17. Our Kelly Kennedy sat down with the Durham man who says he's sharing his story to bring awareness about a law that's often overlooked and puts lives in danger. Greg Lyles has seen a lot of things in his 20-year career as a tow truck driver. And he's well aware of the dangers associated with his job. You know, I've had a lot of close calls and a lot of threats and just kept doing my job. But he wasn't prepared for what happened last Friday night. Lyles thought this would be a simple job, pulling a young woman's car out of this ditch right behind me. And it's just a few feet away from his workshop. And this lady drives over the cone that I had it placed. And, and I was like, oh, stop, stop, please stop. She stopped for a second and starts yelling out the window and cussing at me. Lyle says the woman started pushing his truck with her car. Eventually, she backed up and drove off. Yelled out the passenger window as she was going by, you are going to get yours. Lyles didn't take the threat seriously, but says he should have. Once he returned to the shop, a car he didn't recognize pulled up. The Corvette pulls up, didn't scream, but didn't really yell it. But like, did you just have an altercation with my wife? And I pointed with my right arm towards where we were. Yeah, she tried to boom, boom, boom. Lyles was shot in the arm. The bullet shattered his bone. And another bullet is lodged in his ribs. He might need surgery. But for now, all he wants to do is get a message out there. This whole situation transpired because someone did not want to move over. We're there to do a job and help other citizens. Please, just move over. Durham police tell me they are investigating this shooting. In Durham, Kelly Kennedy, CBS 17 News.